Now based on the concepts that we have learned so far, we are going to solve our sums in multiplication. So are you all ready children? Okay. So here is your first question. The question says factor into factor is equal to dash and your options are product, option B multiplicand, option C multiplier, and option D square. Okay. So the first question asks you factor into factor is equal to dash. So factor is nothing but the multiplicand. So multiplicand into multiplicand will give me what children? Very good. It will give me the product. So option A product is the right answer. Clear? Shall we move ahead? Okay. So this is your next question. Multiplication. is the short form of repeated dash and your options are multiplication, option B division Option C, addition. And option D, subtraction. Okay. So, multiplication is the short form of repeated. What did I say? What is it that we uh, substitute multiplication with? Very good. It is addition. So, option C, addition is the right answer. So, instead of adding one thing n number of times, we can substitute by using multiplication. Clear? Shall we move ahead? Okay. So, here is your next question. The question says 43 into 0 is equals to dash and your options are 43, option B 0, option C 1, and option D, 44. So, 43 into 0, it talks about the 0 property of, of multiplication where we have learned that anything multiplied by 0 will be very good, 0. So, which means answer B is the right option. Clear? Shall we move ahead? Here is your next question. 66 into 1 is equal to dash. Your options are 66, option B 1, option C 0 and option D 67. Okay. So, the question says 66 into 1. This is the second property of multiplication which we have learned that anything multiplied by 1 will be the number itself. So, here the number is 66. So, 66 multiplied by 1 will be good. It will be 66. Clear? Shall we move ahead? Okay. Here is your next question. 74 into 21 is equal to 21 into dash and your options are 74, option B, 21, option C, 1554 and option D, 1. So, this is the third property which says that the product remains unchanged even if the order of the multiplicand changes. So, 74 into 21 will be equal to 21 into, very good, it will be 74. That is option Clear? Shall we move ahead? Okay. 
So here is your next question. The next one says 543 into 10 is equals to dash. And your options are 5430, option B, 5400, option C, 543, and option D, 54300. Okay, so 543 into 10. So now this is the rules of 10s and 100s that we have learned. So 543 into 1 is 543. And this 0 we are going to add towards the end. So what is the answer? It's 5430. Where do you find this? Very good. It's option A. Clear? Shall we move ahead? 